Hi everyone, this is Cook It Bro. Today I'm going to make Korean oxtail soup, which is called Gorigomtang. Winter has come and it's getting cold outside, and I thought oxtail soup is perfect on a cold weather. The ingredient is very simple it's oxtail. And I add hip bones too. Look at the color, looks fresh, isn't it? I think you can get this easily at Whole Foods. If you couldn't get hip bone, it's okay, just use oxtails. So let's start. First of all, we have to drain out the blood. I soak all the meat and bones in cold water for 3 hours. Yeah, I know, it takes time. You see, water changes to red. I replace water every hour, which means twice during the process. See how water color changes during drain procedure. I think it's done. Then discard the water and rinse off meat and bones to remove other impurities or bone chips. And cut out extra fats roughly. Put all the meat and bones into large pot. Fill the pot with enough water to cover them and boil on a high heat just for 30 minutes. Why is it only 30 minutes? Look at these impurities. We need to remove this to get better soup. Take out all the meat and bones and rinse them again in cold water. Oh, don't forget to clean the pot because impurities and fats are still in there. Place them back into the pot, then refill the water and simmer it around 4 hours. Every hour, open the lid and use ladle to skim off impurities and residual oil. I know, be patient. We are almost there. I removed the oxtails from the pot earlier, like after two hours, been simmering, because I want the tail to keep the shape. Unless all the meat will be pulled apart. After four hours of simmering, it's done. Yes. We have rich and milky broth. This meat already pulled apart from the bone. Do you see the bone just dropped out? And look at this. They just pull apart so easily. And it goes to my mouth. Wow, it's so tender. I took some broth out of the large pot and moved it to a small pot with the oxtails. And simmer it for 10 minutes. Finally, ready to eat. I have kimchi as side and diced green onion for seasoning and rice. Wow, it makes me hungry again. I'll show you how I enjoy this meal. It's just my style, so you don't have to follow it. I pick up oxtails out of the bowl. Or you can add salt and pepper for seasoning, but I skipped it because I have kimchi and I don't need any extra salt. It's personal taste. Add green onion and rice into the soup. Let's begin. I so good. Try to add kimchi this time. I think this soup goes well with kimchi. I was so into eating and forgot to filming eating oxtail. It was great though. Alright, that's it for today. Thanks for watching and please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. It really encourages me to make better video. See you next time.